everyone, hoping to answer a frequently asked question for you, talking about the OPS, one of our optional OPS units that you can install in your new line panel. How would you go about installing this and where does it go? Excellent question and I am here to show you. So what we're looking at now is we're actually looking at the left side of one of our new line panels. You can see uh, all sorts of things are going on in here. So we actually have this kind of blocked off area and that's where we're gonna go for our OPS. But you'll see our Wi-Fi module and then of course you have side ports where you can plug in additional hardware. So in order to install your OPS unit, uh, you'll notice that there are a couple of screws covering the OPS port. So I'm gonna go ahead and remove those. And then this plastic cover, all you have to do is just kind of get a hold of it with your hands and just slide it out. Um, so that's all that is, is just blocking that port. And now you can see that OPS slot has opened up. Uh, if you look at your OPS unit here, we've got you know a match there, which is great. As you install it, um, you're gonna see, make sure um, that everything is reading out. Your vents are gonna be in this open area so that way it gets air. All you need to do is take your OPS unit and slide it into this port and push until you feel it click. Um, that way you know it's nice and secure. You do have the option if you want, then you can go ahead and take these screws uh, and screw them back in. That just makes it nice and secure for your OPS unit so that way it can't um, get pulled out by accident or anything like that. So these are made uh, to go back in, which is fantastic. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, get both of those in there. And you can see that is how we install our OPS unit into the side of our new line panel.